first decade after the first decade of Jamaica's independence. This society had been hopelessly divided. There had never been such a concentration of wealth. This concentration started emerging even before. What you have is a situation, therefore, where the country is not really decolonized. The colonial structures, the colonial ways of thinking are still heavy, way heavily in the country. The People's National Party of the 19th century set out to decolonize Jamaica. To be realistic as distinct from romantic, my dream for Jamaica would be to find a way to create a complete mobilization of the Jamaican people so that they were working together to build something instead of like now when they often work against each other and destroy many of the possibilities of progress and change because the truth is you, you can commit yourself to a just society and to the idea of people living well and all that goes with that but if you can't mobilize the people so that they pull together to do it they feel we are Jamaicans this is our country and it's up to us to make it into a great place. You, you'll never be able to realize the dream.